Welcome to another edition of Yes, We're Here. Meredith Morakovitz alongside Carmine Gangone. He is a pizzeria owner in Brooklyn. Carmine, how have you been getting by during the pandemic? Uh, we've been getting by. I mean, we were closed for about 37 days and we reopened the beginning of May. So we're, we're getting there slowly but surely. You know, we're trying to be as careful as possible and just doing takeout orders right now. Since the reopening, you've also been doing some really great things for people that are on the front line. Well, tell us a little bit about that. We've been donating food to a couple of hospitals in uh, New York City, uh, the Hospital of Special Surgery, also at New York Langone. I've also donated some food to all uh, senior citizen homes. A lot of seniors can't get out right now. So matter of fact, last night we donated over 200 meals to a senior citizen home here in Brooklyn. I have to imagine when you show up with some great food, the people are beyond appreciative of everything that you're doing and trying to do for them. Yes, they've been very happy. I mean, you know, everyone loves food, you know, <laughs> especially when something's <laughs> cooked fresh and homemade, they, they, they're happy. So it brings joy to me. When you opened back up, was that on your mind? Was that on the forefront that you wanted to try to help some others? Absolutely. And that's why I took a little break for like the 35, 37 days was just to regroup, get more familiar with the virus, how we, we can be safer here. And definitely, you know, I wanted to donate. I, I love to give back. That's one of my main things is always give back. What are some of the precautions that you've had to take as a restaurant owner in New York City? Well, we're always sanitizing areas. Uh, everyone has masks, gloves on. You know, we're keeping a distance. Uh, when people come inside the pizza place, we give everybody like six feet apart. And if it gets to be a little bit of a line, I usually just tell people to hold off. And everybody's been cooperative. You know, I mean, everybody's been very careful here. Now, I see the shirt. You're a huge Yankees fan. Now, where did your love of the Yankees come about? How did you, how did you start just loving that team? I was a, a Yankee fan. I started back in 81, 81 World Series. I, I was a big Dave Winfield fan. And, you know, they, just losing that World Series was rough. But I remember just getting, you know, becoming more and more of a fan of the Yankees and just the whole aura of the pinstripes, the Yankee Stadium. And from then on, I just, you know, grew more and more. Carmine, I know you've dedicated almost half of your restaurant to the Yankees and memorabilia. Kind of walk me through some of the stuff you have on display there. So we have the 1996 uh, replica World Series trophy. Uh, I have a 98, 99, 2000 World Series ring. Uh, I have photos everywhere, of anywhere from Joe DiMaggio to Derek Jeter, Mariano Rivera, you name Bernie Williams, all of them. Uh, we have over 200 baseballs on display throughout the whole dining area. And then we also have, which is real special to me, is the wood framing of the restaurant is made of, it's out of the Yankee facade. So kind of get a, you get a little bit of the Bronx in Brooklyn. How long did it take you to collect all that memorabilia and make it perfect? I've been collecting since 1995. So, you know, I I've, have stuff in boxes. There's just no more room for anything. So I keep everything in boxes, a lot of stuff. And is that a locker behind you? Yes. You can see the Dominically jersey. I have a bunch of baseballs, the World Series trophy. Mattingly was my guy, so he get, he gets to, his jersey gets to be in the locker. Now, I understand that the current Yankees manager, Aaron Boone, recently paid a visit to the restaurant. Yes, Aaron Boone came by with Jack Curry. Uh, they did a yes uh, interview, and Mr. Aaron Boone made some pizza. How was he? Did he know what he was doing? I, I tell you, he was ready to go. He did a great job. I mean, he was... He was you on point. He did a great job, but did you actually try the pizza he made? Actually, he took his pizza home. He wanted to bring it to his family. But for a rookie, he could have won rookie of the year. Let me let me tell you that. I like it. I like it. I imagine that was such a thrill for you to have the Yankees manager uh, in your shop. Oh, absolutely, I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it very much. If people are looking to order online or they'd like to donate so you're able to continue to help feed some of those first responders, people on the front lines, people in nursing homes, how would they go about doing that, Carmine? Uh, they could send me a message on my Instagram at, at Carmine's Pizzeria, or they can send me an email at cgpizza at aol.com. Carmine, thank you so much for the time. We really appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Stay safe.